Hey guys, Game Master three one nineteen ninety nine here. We're on back to more. Let's play. Daddy going. Slide two. Band of thieves. If we can trust Murray's informant, that's the silo with the battery hidden inside. To prepare it for travel, we'll have to drain off its northern light energy. By attaching a boat's grappling hook to the top of the silo, we should be able to deplete power from the battery. Murray's in position to help throw you out onto the boat. Once on board, I'll hack into its steering controls and move the vessel close enough to fire its grappling hook. Okay, I'll climb on top of the silo and attach the hooks. How many grappling lines will it take to drain the battery? Three should suffice. Once oh, the first great. line's attached, Murray and I will commandeer another boat. You should stay in oh, position. Great, great, Finally, great, 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 great. <laughs> I'm all set to throw you to that boat. These days, my aim is impeccable. Now to hack the steering controls. Oh no, hacking! Oh god damn it. Really? Hacking. At least that was easy. Oh man, I spoke too soon. I spoke way too soon. Oh, what the hell? So nice that one was the autopilot. The boat's heading into position. I'm already on top of the silo. Shoot the grappling hook up to me, and I'll make sure it gets attached to the battery. Oh, really? I should head out for another boat before anyone picks up on what we're doing. Okay. <laughs> Poop. Oh yeah, guess what? I got an HGPVR. should head out for another boat before anyone picks up on what we're doing. So, uh, yeah. I got it, won't we'll use it. Oh, trust me, I'm gonna be... Christmas card upside down. Who are you? <laughs> hey. So yeah, I won't be able to use the HP VR until Christmas. But there's a bunch of HP projects that are continuing and uh great. Oh! 
Got it. So close. So happy. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I really had to do that. <laughs> okay, so slide onto the tower. The second hook's in place. One more grapple line to go, and this That's thing will be on yeah. empty. There's a woolly mammoth. Hey! It's kind of... It's kind of loud. I was wondering what happened to that guy. Guess he just prefers to be frozen. from the last <laughs> Hey, hey, hey. You, mm, ah. Oh, kill me.
computer went to sleep. The video is going to be all goddamn screwed up. As if I don't have enough problems with the video already. Really? They waiting for me. Probably the most annoying thing in any of the Sly games. There better not be annoying stuff like this in Sly 4. I mean, yeah, there's probably gonna be... Bentley's moving by himself. I know there's probably gonna be a couple annoying parts. Probably rescuing the ancestor anything like and i mean i they have hank minigame i know muscle minigame this like it's gonna be hell I, <sighs> who's controlling the boat Chamber empty, we'll be all set to move in. If we're gonna get an eagle egg, you'll first have to destroy all the local oil mains. It looks pretty sturdy. The Murray is strong, but his fists can't punch through metal. No problem. See that old This is a fun there? mission. His name is Grizzleface. The guards ignore him because he's blind and practically nerve dead, except for his sense of smell. If that old guy smells fish, there's no stopping him. Use Grizzleface to take out the oil mains. But I don't smell like fish, do I? How can I lure him around? Bentley's taken up a post along the river. He'll keep tossing bombs into the water and the fish should get blown sky high. Plenty should land near your position. So, you want me to throw a fish at the oil main so that old grizzle face will knock him apart? That's the idea. You might even try throwing fish at the guards. Might improve their odor. Old grizzle face. be really good at this mission. Hey, come here! I used to be really good at this mission.
There we go. What? You freaking old grizzle face. You really are blind, aren't you? God damn. Brought old Grizzleface over to the next oil main by luring him with fish. Grizzle face. Grizzle face. Oh my god! Oh my god, there's a grizzle face! Oh my god. Grizzle face, here buddy! Grizzle face! Grizzle face! Hey! Oh, grizzle face. Didn't even have one. What's the next one? Oh my god. Let's see. Come on, come on. Grizzle face. There you are. Oh my god! <laughs> Bentley's trying to get me killed. The old grizzle face is over here. Oh my god, mighty. Oh great. All the way the hell down here. Grizzle face is moving towards your position. Oh, Grizzle face. Oh, Grizzle face. Good. 
My girl. Can run pretty fast. He's on the oh, old girl face. Girl face. Sensors in the safe house Can't indicate the grizzle even. face is on the move. Okay, it's good. That bear can run pretty fast. He's on the way. All at work, Murray. Now that the yes. wall lights are exposed, Sly's all set up for a paragliding job off the lighthouse. <laughs> Chip back at the safe house for a thermal ride. Hey, Rizzis, what's up? Oh, you frick. Took him out. Where's the goddamn safe house at? Really? None of these guys have any treasure. Oh, uh-uh, not happening. Hey! Glitch. Oh, you can see that was a solid glitch right there. I really want to know how one K turns into two. Come on, Sly! What the hell, you goddamn raccoon! Mm -mm. Hey, again!
That was close. That was really close. John Bisson in the Lumberjack games, we'll need to enlist the help of the giant Canadian eagles. Their nest is out on that iceberg. Steal one of the eggs, and then bring it safely back to the safe house. We'll use it to direct the eagles' protective instincts against Bisson. Sure, sounds easy enough. Except for the part where I have to swim a half a mile through freezing water. Why swim when you can paraglide? With the oil mains all destroyed, the pent-up combustible materials have just caught fire. I see. The updraft created by the flame should give me some extra altitude. Let's make sure to start the fire. Get too close, that old grizzle face will be eating barbecued raccoon for dinner. Ship That's drowned. That's a charming image, Bentley. <laughs> Okay, so really? Highest peak. So. Sometimes I have trouble with this, sometimes I don't. Stay out of the flames. Really? Because my color blindness gets the best of me. Hmm. That's one of the that's one of the reasons. Um, second reason is I can't hold down the R1 button as it seems for a long time. Trust me. Ah! Cut that out. Ah, god damn it. This is where this mission gets irritating. <sighs> Patience. Is the one thing you really need for this mission, and patience is the one thing I don't have right now because it's 1:45 at night. <laughs> ah! Hey, old Grizzleface, what's up? Man, he's huge. That's a huge, huge bear. Glitch! 
Oh, thank God! For glitches! Oh, yeah! Excellent job! If you could get that eagle egg back to the safe house, we'll be all set for the lumberjack game. Look, it's a woolly mouth. Shoot. Great work, Sly. Next time on Sly 2 Band of Thieves. Lumberjack games are upon us. Now, despite Murray's study of the long chopping guide, none of us are skilled enough to beat John Bassad at his own game. So, though it pains me to say it, we'll have to cheat. Murray, you'll participate in the power log chopping competition. Get us a good score, and then let Bassad up for his turn. While he's chopping, I'll sneak the eagle egg into his trousers and the protective <laughs> parrot disturb his axe swings. Sly, given your ascension skills, I've signed you up for the ice wall climb. That's a pain. You'll keep a from real beating pain. your score by pulling him off the wall with some nearby grappling lines. And finally, I'll represent our team That's in the log rolling competition. With my knowledge of rotational mechanics, we're sure to get a stupendous score. Sly will be in charge of greasing Basad's log so he has no chance of beating it. If you guys are ready, I say we head out and show these meathead lumberjacks what we're made of. So, that will be happening next time on Sly 2 Band of Thieves Special Can... 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 Canada?